Hello guys, welcome to the Edu Mobile iPhone programming course. Today we are going to have a small look at what are we going to learn all through this course. So let's see what all we are going to discuss. Okay, so we'll primarily start with the basic C programming. Now uh, we know some of our students are not programmers or primarily have programmed uh, in a distant past. So uh, it's important for us to make sure that uh, we give them a proper platform before uh, actually taking them over to the iPhone programming so we will generally start with a very basic C programming so this is not to say that this will not make you a C guru of course but it will uh, actually be a head start uh, towards objective C so as we learn the basic concepts in C we will slowly migrate to objective C and we will learn about objects object oriented programming concepts which are very much uh, unique to objective c and how an objective c program is different from a c program we will see all those features moving over we'll talk about advanced objective c uh, concepts of id concepts of uh, polymorphism or a late binding uh, or a inheritance in an objective c program so uh, primarily the idea is that once you are halfway through the course you are pretty much comfortable in objective C so that uh, your ideas can be easily replicated onto your program that you will be writing for the iPhone of course this goes without saying that you need to work on the assignments that has been given read more uh, than what is being told and actually practice a lot so this will definitely need your uh, effort and you will help to you will have to actually work a lot uh, if you are very new to programming and initially the things may look a bit steep but if you continue with it the things will start to ease out and you will be able to get things uh, quite quickly now in addition to generic programming our primary aim is to learn iPhone programming so uh, the aim is to from hello world to the accelerometer the we'll start our first week with the salary uh, with the hello world uh, a simple hello world application we will then move on to uh, the basic and advanced user interface like how uh, you actually create interfaces for iPhone applications the the NIF file and the interface builders and how they are being used in conjunction with the Xcode development environment we will also move on to create those GUIs programmatically learn about concepts of auto rotation and auto sizing which are uh, the app which is to control the behavior of your program when you actually rotate your phone in a particular direction either horizontally or vertically we will then work on multi view applications where there are more than one views where suppose you are creating say a media player so one of your views may contain the actual media player where the media gets played and the other one may actually contain the index so these are actually different views and we will see how multi view applications are being created for iPhone moving over it moving over we will talk about tab views and table views the tab views uh, as the name suggests uh, the views specific to iPhone wherein there are different tabs and each view is actually present in each tab the table views on the other hand is the table listing of all the data that you read through a file or through a plist 
now uh, moving on to more advanced topics we'll talk about data persistence how you actually need to if you need to store data permanently onto the memory of an iPhone uh, how will you go about doing it drawing on an iPhone uh, how you draw basic geometrical figures if you are creating a game how do you do that and uh, we will move over to the other uh, interesting topics of the salarometer and the camera where you can um, take pictures through the iPhone camera and put it onto your application and use it uh, to create uh, the content for your users we will also create some demo programs which will help us understand the touch and the gestures that are allowed in the iPhone which is primarily a touch device in addition to all this programming uh, that we will be working on we will also understand the basic architecture of uh, how uh, iPhone OS has been built uh, in order to have a clear understanding while you are actually creating an, uh, creating an application how we will how uh, uh, idea can be easily transported to the iPhone what are the best practices to do that so we will be talking about all that also in our program I hope you will enjoy it and very best of luck